Picture the dream. Your passing is sharp, at the right time, with the right weight, and most of all, accurate. You zip it around the pitch at speed. It doesn't matter how quick the defenders are, you're always one step ahead. To develop these passing skills, you need to practice rondos. This is a passing exercise, used by the passing masters of Barcelona and Spain. Not only does it refine your ability to pass the ball with tempo, but it also hones your decision-making, movement and technical skill. Players will love the competition. At the end of the video, I'll share a coaching tip that might surprise you. Enjoy the video and hit subscribe. With the help of the jokers on the outside, ask the team in possession for a set number of passes before being allowed to score. If you're coaching younger players, try to encourage success by starting with free play, progressing to a small number of consecutive passes, and make the exercise bigger to allow more time to make adjustments. There are many challenging progressions available to you. You can allow scoring in any goal or each team can only score in two of the goals diagonally opposite. A good progression that helps players with decisions and timing is to introduce a rule where a goal can only be scored from a bounce pass off one of the outside players. To engage players in competition, ask the players to keep the scores themselves. The training theme is possession, so try to only offer coaching around possession. Resist the temptation to talk about intensity, tackling, work rate, defending, and other points that belong in another exercise. If you have an odd number of players, play with a third joker inside the square who plays with the team in possession. One of your progressions could be that before scoring, the ball has to go through the middle joker. My final coaching tip for you is to ask the players during rondos to keep their distance from the ball carrier whenever possible. This helps maintain the space around them. If you come short all the time, you bring the pressure with you, and if you do get the ball, your space, time and options are limited in an already reduced space. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more simple coaching videos.